Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to the channel. Now I'm going to do my round 10 tips. I feel a little bit ill, but I'm fine. Um, I've got my doggo. Hang on. Yeah, doggo just there, sweeping away. So I got 4 out of 9 last week and 51 total points I have. My tip. Uh, I went with a few upsets. 50-50-50 mm, cool. Uh, but yeah, so let's go to the round 10 tips. So we've got Carlton versus Sydney. Now a lot of people go on Carlton, but and it's a Marvel stadium and it's probably one of the worst stadiums to uh, you know, to play at. Um to watch it's not too bad, but to play at I feel like the MCG is a lot better. Uh I reckon, you know, Carlton should be playing Sydney at the S uh not the S C G the M C G. Um, you know. It'd be pretty cool uh, to see see that on a Friday night, I guess. But anyways, uh, I don't know the tip to be honest. Teams come out tonight, but um, yeah, I'm not sure. I might have to go. I'm thinking of going Sydney just because Buddy Franklin and that. Uh, you know the forwards if they get going, they're really dangerous to stop. But they haven't been crash hot since like round three, two ish. Um, but I'm I guess I've got to go Carlton. So I'm going to tip Carlton and close one by eleven points. I just feel like Carlton could have one of their best seasons like in years. Like they're finally showing some stuff that they've you know been capable of for the last seven years. And they just haven't quite got there. So we've got Geelong, Geelong Port, no messing around. I think Geelong to win by ten goals honestly i don't really think that port will match us um i'll be actually live streaming the game instead of going because i've got my 21st celebration so i don't really you know want to miss that uh i take 21st celebration and i'm gonna do a vlog on that uh so stay tuned for that as well um so we got the western bulldogs uh gold coast game now gold coast you know what i'm going an upset I'm going Gold Coast. I just feel like Gold Coast can actually win this game. I know Bulldogs have found their form finally, but I just feel like Gold Coast, like they played impressive footy last week. I didn't watch the game, but knowing the Freo fans and having a look at the comments there, and they're like, Suns played pretty well. So, North Melbourne versus Melbourne at Marvel. Now, Melbourne are decent at Marvel Stadium, but not really North Melbourne anymore. So, I don't know. I do want to just go and upset, but I can't. Melbourne, nobody's going to beat them this year. They're going to go 22 and 0. That's just my prediction. Or they'll just drop this game and go 21 and 1. Adelaide versus St Kilda. Um, at Adelaide Oval, I'm thinking of going Adelaide, but after what they, what I saw against uh us Cutters, they were pretty decent. So I don't know. I'm going to have to go to St Kilda there, and they were pretty ordinary against uh GWS. Adelaide were at home especially, uh, so I'm going to have to go Adelaide. I mean, not Adelaide, St Kilda. All right, so the next one is Richmond versus Essendon. Now, Essendon are finally finding their form-ish, but at the same time, Richmond are killing it at the moment. Uh, you know, never count them out. You can't k count out a champion side. And whatever Dusty does, if he plays this week, or he, you know, retires, whatever he done, whatever he does, any team would love to have him. In the side, he's just a champion on and off the field. So I'm going to have to go Richmond. Richmond by probably 27 points. So I forgot to do the margins for the other game. Uh, I'm going to go Melbourne by 87. And then I'm going to go St Kilda by five goals. So we've got Hawthorne, Brisbane Lions, actually, and Suns, sorry. Suns by 11. So we got Brisbane versus Hawthorne at the, I was going to say MCG, but it's University of Tasmania. And normally Hawthorne show up at that. So I'm going to go Hawthorne to beat Brisbane. Big, big call, but you just never know. I'm probably going to change it depending on the teams anyways. But anyways, um, so the next one is Freo versus Collingwood. Now, Collingwood have been, you know, Better than what anyone expected, to be honest. Um, but I don't know. Freo, they've played some okay football. They haven't been at their best yet. Like, yes, they've won some of the games and stuff, but they've sort of had an easier road. Uh, you know, obviously, it was a really, really, really good win against the Catters. You know, we were just poor, and Freo was just too good uh, in those later moments. But I don't know. I just feel like mm, Freo could turn it up another level and beat Collingwood by 50 points, or Collingwood could show up and win by 17, um, or three goals. But it'll be a close game. Uh, I'm thinking of Fremantle. Yeah, let's just go with Fremantle stuff, eh?
Uh, Fremantle win by, I, was, I said 50, but I'm going to go 10 points, stuff it. And then I've got to say Hawthorne by five points. I feel like this round is going to be a lot closer than the others that have been you know, it's been quite difficult. Like, you know, you expect teams to win. And, yeah, I've got 51. I don't really care about tipping anymore. Um, you know, I'm just struggling so much. Where am I? I went down 156,000 spot. I, I was in the top 70, no, 57,000 at one point, And I've just... Oh. I've just choked. I don't know what's going on, but, you know, it's for fun. I don't really care. Mom, there's no, like, oh, there is competition stuff and prize money stuff for different comps, but I'm just like, I'm just chilling, you know, living my life. Uh, but no, nah, look, it's pretty cool uh, to to get 51 so far. I feel like that's pretty good. But, yeah, that's the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. If you heard a snore, it's from, uh, where do you go? This far. Just snoring over there. But, yeah, that's the video. Thanks so much for watching. And and I will see you possibly either tomorrow with a video or Saturday with a stream. Anyways, that's the video. Thanks so much for watching and peace.